Alright! After a long drought of just not doing stuff, we're back finally with something actually different than my usual Resident Evil. This just in, RPG new, as I, as nice as I like to say it, RPG noob plays plays an RP plays Final Fantasy V in Fiesta mode, more at eleven. Bum bum bum. Oh no. You'll be fine. You sure about that? Because again, it's my first time. Shark, I swear to God, if you fucking crash. <laughs> okay. Just like what it did to me, or what 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 my computer did to me this morning. Yeah. <laughs> Presented by Squeenix. Also, it goes without saying we're using the GBA tech support with the with the bug fix patch and a and a patch that Steel had of running, allowing running. Also, for all party members, not just Steve. And also, damn it, Nobu Uematsu. <laughs> what about him? I say that's a joke because it's a running joke in the community. <laughs> is them because people like to joke about the fact that no it's Tetsuya Nomura that, that people joke about. No. <laughs> you and your goddamn belts <laughs> Yeah because I was gonna say why are we call out boy Matsu sama here because <laughs> the dude is obsessed with belts not Uematsu No not Uematsu I meant Nomura yeah. Mode 7! Glorious Mode 7. Also, you'll be happy to know that I have the loadout both in Twi on Nightbot and on the side of the, of the stream. I also have a different- I also have another command. Exclamation <laughs> point, thanks IHI. Thanks, I hate it. Yeah, I was gonna say, you don't need a voice act. It's yeah, bad enough I'm, I'm doing it in my own run. You don't because, need to do it on your it own. Because it moves on its own, so... Yeah. No control here. As even if you have control in non-cutscene stuff. Since it's auto-playing, just, just mute the audio and replace it with random dialogue from Speed Racer. It's pretty much the same thing. <laughs> 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 Which funny or thing, even better. Turner actually doesn't own that dub anymore. Funimation owns all rights to Speed Racer now because Speed Racer Enterprises doesn't exist anymore. <laughs> He's going over that cliff! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Why do I have that in my head now? Are you my brother, Rex Racer? <clears throat> you are his brother! I can see the resemblance, even underneath that mask! Egg! Egg! No, better yet, I should, I should be quoting the variant with Dr. Weird. Are you my brother, Rex Racer? You tell me! <laughs> Hi, Ferris. 
The squirming sprite, mission level 30. Hell no. <laughs> We don't know his name yet. All we know is that he's an old man. And therefore requires Metamucil. This doesn't go long enough for my computer screen to just turn off to go into sleep mode. Oh uh, yeah, my monitor did that to me once. Yeah, there's a reason why I turn off sleep mode. <laughs> yeah, me too. Hey, we finally have control now. Uh, speaking of which, what level am I? Uh, 37, okay. It's potato! Turn off his to put out the fire, and yes, we do have control now. Good. And now you can save. Uh, Come to that wide, wide world of Michael Fantasy Five. So anyway, here is our main hero. <laughs> this also tells you that the intro is four minutes long. <laughs> Uh, you gotta find the meteor. Oh, hey, a meteor. Come on, Boko, let's go! Oh! Boko, wait here, okay? Stop, Boko, wait for me here! Okay, Boko, he let's go! I think it'd be funnier sounding like Jake than he would meet one. <laughs> and our first active time battle. Great. At least this it, apparently eases us into it. It's as, yeah. it's as basic as you can get. I don't even think these goblins can do goblin punch, so you should be fine. Uh, they can do Goblin Punch, but you have to be really stupid to leave them lo alive long enough. <laughs> okay, yeah, now I have control of the text. And, uh, he, uh, I believe because he's doing a normal run, he will not get Blue Mage. Because he's already got a knight. Probably yeah. not. What are you gonna All name right, him? Alright, I forgot I'm that, I'm gonna keep uh, him the actual name, fuck that. Well, if you wanted to give him the actual name, it should have been I'm Butts. I'm not doing Butts. I, I refuse to acknowledge No, that you should have called him Balls Johnson. <laughs> Why should I do it? Sykes already done it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I called him Farts once. <laughs> and another time I called him Warts. And then in another, I called him Boots.
Oh, you actually did it right to them. I thought the game would take over at that point. Whoa, where am I? Snakes alive! There's a boot in my oh. snakes! Because he's, he's a, an old man. Because he's Cause a he's dirty he... old man. I know it's... <laughs> and all that whatnot. Yo-ho-ho -ho and stuff. Uh, if you go to the right... Ah, uh, yes, there is a... Item. Yeah, there's a hidden item. Or a, a chest. To be more accurate. I will take that, because I know how useful the extents are. And considering in this world they cost a thousand gil a pop, yeah. Yeah, they're you'll kind wanna... of expensive. It's not that big a deal once you get into the later worlds, but right now, you really want to squeeze every gill you can get. <laughs> oh no, it just leads back. No. Alright. Couldn't go to the right. Nothing to do in the forest, so that just leaves one direction. Goblins, whatever will you do? If you find that battles are moving too fast for your liking, you can adjust the speed in the main menu. Yeah, and if it isn't already on that mode, I would highly recommend uh, switching from active to wait. It's on wait by default. Okay, so yeah, you're fine. Just like human. Mm, chicken. Work tastes like human. Halt, I am Boko. That's hungry. Butts want eat! Halt, <laughs> I am Boko. Halt, <laughs> I am Reptar! <laughs> Halt, I am... 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 Somebody call their mom! Not unless you have a chocobo with you. So how else are you gonna jump over those pits?
How can the wind be calling you if the wind is dead? Yeah. Something about that. <laughs> Hence why uh, Galoof called him out on his bullshit. Why else would he Hence say such a sweet talker? That's why Galif is the best character besides Gilgamesh. That is true. When he dies, people actually give a damn and try to revive him. Spoiler alert. Yeah, but then they prove to future generations that it doesn't work. <laughs> so why bother? Because I get the feeling since he is bare-fisted and not a monk, that means, obviously, his fists do jack-all. Oh, it already, right is, uh, oh, it already is on weight. I guess left was possible. Yeah. Uh, for battle speed, uh, lower numbers mean is faster and a higher number lower. So... Five. I usually put it on four. <laughs> Saw that coming. No, not oh that. god, it's blinding! It's not that high, Brett. Fuck you, asshole. It's blinding! No! Oh yeah, I forgot you can only save on the overworld. Yep, four save points. They're pretty well placed, though. Mm. They connected, they just didn't do any damage. Because again, unless you're a monk, going barehanded is stupid. Yeah, Almost you're like not I gonna find him a weapon. Almost you're like not I gonna find him a weapon for a while. Much of a choice right now. <laughs> Besides, at least your first job is a knight. It could have been worse, and... No, yeah, like, and that had a white mage last year or something. I mean, I'm not gonna complain, it's just... Uh, I think uh, Psych had white... Oh, no, wait, no, it was Pan. Last year had Oops All White Mage. <laughs> oh, crap. That was a time. Plus, I think oh, the second job he got was something that couldn't be used until fire class was unlocked. So, <laughs> even more of a reason for it to be Oops All White Mage. I remember that agony all too well. Well, at least now, at least I know what the animation is for critical hits. Yeah, it's a seizure flash. Critical. Down the GBA version, right? Um, maybe. 
for the record, kind of hard to tell from memory. For the record, only barehanded and katanas, which are wielded by samurai, uh, can actually do critical hits. Please don't crash, please don't crash, please don't crash. Oh, thank God. Oh, uh, do, th you, do you think your, uh... My drivers are gonna crash again? Probably. Oh, dear. Yeah, it's been going on for the past two months. It doesn't do it every time I turn on the PC, only, like, once every two and a half weeks. It sounds to me there's something wrong with your video card. Yeah, that's what I'm assuming. Oh, uh, I guess I can't use. That. Or no, it's equipped. No. Yeah. Equipped. Yep. I mean, it's plus one. It's better than nothing. Yep. Congratulations, you found Mighty Number Nine in the chest. We don't talk about that game. Eat, eat, eat. Also, I'm glad the game will actually target. I'm glad that starting with a certain, starting with another Final Fantasy game, they target a specific enemy. If it's targeting a specific enemy, when the, the enemy dies, they don't freaking go. Oh, the enemy's already dead. We can't act. Uh, three started doing yeah, that. Yeah, three was the one that started that trend. But only for physical attacks. For spells, you had to wait until four. Uh, what should our theme for Ferris be? Um, oh, I know. Yar, har, har, we be pirates! It's only in the PS1 version. The fucking PS1 translation. Well, Ferris's quest... Ferris's quest to place every single consonant in the English alphabet in front of Gar. <laughs> Until you revisit this cave at a later point, absolutely nothing. That later point could be very soon, though. True, it could be.
Go to the wheel. Drive the ship. Don't post that. I didn't think it'd be that simple. Yo ho ho and stuff. Now made with 100% more yo ho ho. Merry Christmas to you all! Uh, yeah, uh, yo ho ho and uh, stuff. Hi, Ferris. Hello. It is your what? My goodness, I'm already like halfway to getting full uh, max elixirs, and I get the feeling by the time I reach 75, all of my characters, with the exception of Galoof, is going to master all their jobs. Every time you pronounce it like that, I keep expecting you to say Galoop, and then my mind turns to the <laughs> game Genie. What genius, I was gonna... up, what genius came up with the idea to steal a pirate ship anyway? Hmm, that's a mystery. Mm. Hmm. Look in the mirror. The mirror Look in pops. the mirror, pops. Oh, the um, I can't remember a thing. Uh, and your amnesia oh so conveniently returns. <laughs> you, you need also, some hey, animation. Shadow Derpy. Hello, Shadow Derpy. Hello, Shadow Derpy. Welcome to this bullshit. Oh, we barged into Ferris's room. Barged into Ferris's room earlier. Whoops. <laughs> How did she too get a first place medal? I call bullshit. Because you can. Yeah. Uh. Hello, Mr. Spider. Sometime today, maybe? Into the crow's nest that pirate goes. I just disappeared there for a second. Sildra! 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 Say hello to these landlubbers!
yeah, I can sit here. I don't know anything else to do. It's nice of the game to do that for me, but... Yeah, especially if this is your first time. <clears throat> yeah, no reason not to go here. Yeah. There I'll is a town, know. but... I was gonna say, the only other reason would be to stock up with what you can in town, but at this point, it's there's really no penalty. For like, this first. place is so easy that you don't need to. I just stumbled in here. I'm guessing this is the same, this is the same room. Yeah. You can mm -hmm. drink the drink from the pot to uh, recover. Mm -hmm. And I believe um, the scholar to the left of the pot uh, should give you some free potions. Oh, I forgot that guy gave you potions. Oh, and of course it's the meme number. Five. Um, I do it, but I'm not access. I don't have access to the voice mod yet, because I'm busy fighting for my life. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna get. I think you're playing Neo. Yeah. Yeah, that might do it. I'm gonna kill it in one hit. You see that enemy? Oh, oh hey! Dead. Isn't this the first game to use the tenor? Was that in there since the beginning? Uh, since the beginning. Yeah, since the beginning. Now, this is. The, I owe you. Oh potions. Uh. There, I did it. Happy now. <laughs> restore point? <Yeah. laughs> uh, yep, save, save point. point. Save point, yep. Also, you can. Yeah. As the game just a, mentioned, you can also use a tent or cottage. This is a constipated circle. Oh, it saves your, uh. Color too when you do that. Yep. I mean, for 1992, this game isn't that bad looking. I mean, I've seen worse games that came out in 92. Cough, Bubsy. Yeah. Are we. Yeah. It's just a friendly bird that wants to say hi. Yes, of course. With its wings. Yes. What was your first clue? Cause that's not the sprite they use for the wind drink, so yeah. Hmm. I believe if you go through the door on the opposite end. Then I see a chest. A yeah, chest he head to the right, head to the left. No, no, go back to no, go go. Well, back there might own. be something in that other staircase. Oh, that I need experience by. anyway. Let's just kill these guys. Thirty-five guild experience. Alright. 
I'm getting consistent 45 kill 10 XP right now. I mean, it's not really random. Hey, Gallif now has a weapon. He can actually do shit for once! Yay! I actually oh, don't my, recall how yeah, this Yeah, I can see yeah. why you would recommend that, because he goes from 3 attack to 15 attack. Hell yeah, give me that one. Give me the good shit. Alright. What are you saying about this chest right here? Uh, uh if you were to go cool. downstairs and all the way to the right, it should lead to a staircase going up there. Yes. Well, let's take out the test first. Experience. Who knows, if you're lucky, you might get an elixir from those mold winds. Damn it. I keep forgetting that room is empty. Too bad. Let's just been zonked. Oh, believe oh, me. Good. Uh, oh, wait, no, you can't get it. So I was gonna say, if you get a thief class, their run speed is insane. Yeah, their speed is doubled. Uh, pan I mean, not pan. Steel told me that already. It's part they implement that as part of the patch since everyone else can. Take that phoenix down, thank you. Okay, and those we already used, so... Sure, why not? More fucking experience! Go get another elixir! Possibly. Oh no! More, more leather shoes, that too. This guy's got shoes! It must, must be the shoes. It gives plus one. From downtown. It gives one, honestly, so. Let's give one or something, honestly. 
Dying to the same fireball. It's the same fireball. God damn it, Psych! <laughs> hey, I knew something was off there. It's something I can't use, Zypen, unless I get unless I get wizard or something. I believe staffs uh should be for other mages, because I think uh, the black mages use rods. I did not know that was there. I literally But either way, <laughs> worst case scenario, if you end up getting four jobs and none of them can use it, something you can sell. I literally walked two fucking I mean, at this point, you could just get away with holding down the A button. All that for a good load of nothing! You lose! Good day, sir! Theme from the first game. Yep. Been in every. I was wondering why that wasn't playing on the title screen. <sighs> uh, my guess is that if it involves Final Fantasy, they probably think it's just a insert crystal theme here. That's Final Fantasy. Yep. It's it's so unconic. It's so iconic, they stopped using it oh, after it's 7. Telli it's telling us who each warrior is and where the shrines are at. Water. So I think if memory serves, they did use it once in Final Fantasy X. That was way early in the beginning, and then after that, it's never played again. And even then, it was more of a remix, rather than just the actual theme. Of course, butt says the way. Damn it! Just notice I said butt! <laughs> <laughs> Got to you too. Call that a win. Hello, my name is Butt. I like to use the power of wind. Into this crystal, I use the power of wind. I made the duty. Castile, are you blowing directly into your mic? Uh, yeah, cause I have a. Uh, I'm not. I can't use push to talk. And he doesn't. And he isn't like us. Says he isn't like a few of us that have actual headsets. Yeah, I have actual headsets. Yes. And it's one that was uh, made for the Xbox One. Oof. Like I can, I can pull my mic away if uh, need be. Might help. Uh. 
I was going to say, if you could wrap some foam around the microphone, that might help with There some. is foam around the microphone. Oh. Yes, he, he <laughs> then, then I'm sorry to say your foam needs foam. Uh. All right, time for Oops All Nights. Once, it, once again, it lets me get in and it lets me access the job system. If not immediately, once you leave the shrine, that's the definite time it will let you switch. Eat shit. Eat shit, fire monk. <laughs> Like I said before, for 1992, this honestly isn't bad looking. So hi, Chocobo. I don't know what you're talking about. I am Oko War. Uh, since this is my first time, hell yes! Okay. So I was gonna say, as far as switching jobs go... Don't really need a tutorial, but it does talk about uh, equipping a secondary ability. So for that, yeah, I'd say it's worth it. I'm gonna guess that that red bar over there would be the overscan area. Focusing. I bet the auto equip's gonna be my best friend in some instances, not all of them. Yep, once you get an elven mantle, it definitely is trying to work against you. No, better yet, once you get bone mail, it works against you. Once you get Excalibur, it also works against you. <laughs> It only serves two purposes, being thrown and if you are casting magic spells, because it raises magic. Other than that, it uh, is just it's as also it sounds, useful. Excalibur. It's also useful for Goblin Punch. Ability? Oh, AP. ABP, Ability Why would punch. you call it ABP? It's, it's literally just got, or no, AP is action points. Actually, yeah, that's a good So it's actually ab points. You're trying to work on your abdominals. Boy, do I ever. Did I even get soft because that's all there is? Well, that is it for me. I am out of here. Work. I must go. Okay, you can't. Oh, it's because we're all freelance. Freelance doesn't have. Nope. You have no abilities to equip, anyways. Not yet. No, you and even work. then, um, usually the abilities you get are pretty standard for knights, unless they're specific. Uh, uh, some abilities, abilities are innate and can be transferred to other classes. So you won't need to equip them, and some abilities you do need to equip. Like, let me bring this up, since I'm already... At the uh, for example, knights will eventually learn the uh, ability two-handed. Yes. And you need to equip that in order to take advantage of it. If you head back to the pirate cave, there is, uh, there are some goodies there for you. Well, Do not go that's this way. There are actually powerful monsters there, and considering the I'm lack of armor so, you have... Yeah, bad idea. 
Yeah. I mean, you can take it, but you're also ill-equipped. Yeah, it's mainly the fact you're ill-equipped to Where's handle the this. Game? This uh, is actually the best route to take. Go down and hug the left wall. Because what you want to do is get on to dry land, so that way you can climb your way back up to the cave. Oh god, goblins! Hey, I'll take oh, good. goblins Learn. in the desert more than the fucking sandworms. There is one sandworm in the game, and it's a boss. Yeah. Mm -hmm. After what happened in Resi 3, I hate <laughs> I walked a single foot! Damn! Is, is, is that gonna be why every time you load up Worms Armageddon, your first uh, reaction is, God damn it! We got oh worm God, signs the like to Oh, God damn it! <laughs> it's just a sound clip of Constantine. Yeah, only Pan has it so. We got worm signs the like to Blitz even. Because Constantine actually made it a uh, sound alert. <laughs> we got worm signs the likes of which even God has never seen. Oh, yep, I remember where we were at. He didn't try to go after us. half damage when you're in the back row unless your weapon is specifically does full damage in the back they, row. They were taking... They were, no, I was talking about, like, right now. Because all of them were in the front row. Well, no. All of them were in the back row because of the back attack. You know what I meant. Can't and you can't enter from there unless you use an airship or something. Well, yeah. The and the is thing is, that cave really doesn't have any true significance until the final world. Otherwise, it's just there just to be there. It, it serves no purpose. Okay, so I did the math. To fully master all abilities of knights, you need a total of 690 ability points. Alright, uh, first of all, talk to the lower pirate. Back out. Yeah, talk to him. Huh, I thought he was supposed to give you, like, eight potions. I believe after the event in town. Oh, then that right. Happens. Right. 
There, that should open the, the door with the chest. Gets that. I played it! Pizza time! Oh I yeah, no money. Pizza time. Oh yeah, no money. Oh yeah, no money. Not yet, Ben. Also high. Also Hi, high, Ben. <laughs> also high. Also, he has delay. Fuck and ten go. Fuck. <laughs> we be pirates and we do as we please. You do what you want because a pirate is free. Because let's face it, you are a pirate. Thank you for the host. Thank you for the host. Also, I'm so ashamed that one pirate specifically is not in that area. Though, again, I'd imagine you have to trigger the amount in order for that to happen. It serves very little purpose, but I just find it hilarious. I think you can, yeah, you can walk around him. I hate my depth perception, Jesus Christ. <laughs> What What depth perception? I can't tell that they're... <laughs> like... Like... Okay. Just a point of perspective. Like this... Like this, yeah, like right there, I know that I can't <laughs> there. Like, it, it's hard for me to tell where the actual bounding box is. Fair enough. <laughs> also, key perspective. Isometric well, perspective does that. It, it, it could I, be a hell. It, it honestly could be a hell of a lot worse. It could be Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves for the NES, where they try to do 3D esque style graphics, and it's just bigger blocks that you could butt your head into trying to move around. Uh, yeah, you, can, you can't walk through the things that are in the foreground. That game sounds familiar. Uh, I would hope it isn't. Because it sucks. I feel like I've heard of that game before. You know, at some point I should do a ROM dumpster diving with that. Or even, hell, if I really felt insane enough, a full playthrough from beginning I mean, to end. Why not add it to... You could give that to I mean, a Why not start out with it? Like, why not start out with it on Sunday? Give it to Pan for all those shit games. <laughs> you know he can hear you, right? Yes. Because we had the same exact conversation before in the red, in the red, during the Resi 1 playthrough. <laughs> he was like, you know you, he can hear you, you right? You used to give it to Pan for all those shit games. You do realize Pan can hear you, right? All right. So anyway, you're gonna give this the pan for all those shit games anyway. Yes. Uh. I don't care if you. Resi One stream was a was a masterpiece. Despite it being one of my first actual things, like true things, I feel like. You know what? Uh, I'll. I'll admit, Robin Hood Prince of Thieves is not a good NES game. It's definitely better than any of the Advanced Dungeons & Dragons games for the NES. Oh god, the Advanced Dungeons & Dragons games, holy f- oh. Heroes of the Lands! Uh, Warriors oh, of the yeah. Eternal Sun was Genesis, right? Yeah, that's Genesis, and it's actually, you know, decent. Were most of those developed by Westwood? I don't remember, actually. Cause I know the Famicom- I know the NES ones are developed by Pony Canyon or something like that. I know that they were published in Japan by Pony Canyon. 
I thought they were developed by a sentient pile of shit. Cover is an innate ability. Yeah, so to. that really doesn't mean anything. I think the first one you get is when you reach level 3 knight when they earn two-handed weapon. Yeah, it allows you to forego a shield to do double damage. Which, honestly, I'm surprised that's not a samurai ability. I think that's what they realized later on in the series and decided, yeah, it's it's basically a samurai ability. I just find it shocking that it's a knight ability. Alright, so now our true destination. Where is that? Town? Uh, yep. up and to the left. Beer, beer! Oh yeah, this is going off. Of, oh yeah, this is going off the U.S. version, so they have to call it Grog because, because the game was, yeah. E10, was E10 Plus on Game Boy Advance. That's right. Wasn't the PS1 version rated T for Team, regardless? Hey, I honestly don't remember. I don't know. Let's find out. Well, we can't do piano right now. You can. Uh, right after this. You see, lap dances are a prerequisite in order to play pianos in this world. You know, kids! You know, for kids! Rated E for everyone! Yeah, yeah, that's right. Trying to get those piano muscles flexing. That's uh, you're correct. The PS1 version is rated T. At least that makes sense. Lap dancing for E10 Plus? Uh, I didn't know what? he was there. Oh, I didn't know there was- I didn't know there was a guy there. <laughs> it, it's not like I'm looking at these sexy ladies, baka. Uh, speaking of, let's check on Ferris. For Galoof and Butts to question their sexuality. Oh, were they at. They don't yet know that Ferris is a woman. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah they, they haven't run into Darby oh, Private Shame! Uh, I already have that. So, yeah. Let's get you learning, Boy Soiker. Uh, oh, don't have it, though. Someone's grinding. Yes, because since I don't have a healer, I'm grinding for elixirs. Ah, fair enough. Well, let's go with the... I guess let's go with the... Plants uh, over there. Let's go with the show. What's your party again? Uh, oh, have yeah. with okay. me monks. Berserker, Ninjas, and Samurai. Okay, I, I... Oh my god, it's oops all physical. So, yeah. yes, I need to cry for a no. laser. Otherwise, no, go back I in there. get fucked in there. Go back in then. There, there's free stuff in there. But also, uh, when she asks if you're uh, new to this, say no. <laughs> okay, go go back in and okay, say yes. Yeah. In all seriousness, go in there and say yes. Yeah, you, there's free stuff in here. 
and general tutorial messages on how uh, the game works. Alright, I'm working on about 40 years. So in that case, uh... Oh, hey, wait a second! Hidden passages. What a concept! What a twist. Got a trap! I guess that's probably there to... for, for grinding. Uh, no, it's there to it's demonstrate. It's more or less to teach you that there are some chests that are there just to be there, and then there are some that have monsters inside. Yes, but the ones that have monsters inside usually have good treasure. <laughs> hey, you know, that thing that's only available to thieves in the game normally. Yeah, now you can do it all the time. Oh, blue mages. Blue oh, mages. Blue mages basically have metronome, really? No, blue mages uh, can learn enemy abilities. <laughs> They're more... The, they're more like the enemy skill in Final Fantasy VII. Uh, that, that's a, mm -hmm. Okay, you have to hold L and R together. Okay. Yeah, that's all you run. But honestly, I'd say having Blue Mage is okay. It's at your best when you have Beast Masters with you as well. Yeah. Because then you can manipulate uh, getting all the blue magic abilities. Yep. I mean, even on its own, Blue Mage is kind of broken. That's what the left thing was. Okay, so yeah. Oh, in here. What did yeah, you do in the battle? Because I, cause I saw that it. Oh, uh, press you press. Oh, you press left to switch rows during battle. Okay. <laughs> okay. And the defend command is when you press right. Yeah. Even ah. if you're, even if you're back attacked, it's still the same thing. Left is row, and right is defend. Yes. No, because we already had it. Alright, now... I know it means absolutely nothing, but I feel like it should be like, when you're done, it opens the gate for you. Thanks for stopping by, have a nice day, and then still kicks your ass out of there. <laughs> I mean, you can go back in there and do that again. <laughs> okay, so I'm noticing that with the rod of a step, I'm guessing that the uh, when they're to the right, when they're to the left, that means they can use it. Okay, that's what I figured. Mm -hmm. uh, well, we have we have two of them already. One, I believe. I believe. Uh, you have two memory of them serves. Uh, Bar Bards on. came equipped with one, and you gave the other one to Galoof. So two. I'm not worried about the other two. Yeah. I'm not worried about the other two items right now. No. Unfortunately, you won't be able to actually equip Ferris until you leave. Nah, but at least, okay, at least you're set away, to do that. Though. Yeah. Shield is probably for, like, defensive stuff. Yep. Armor! Hey! 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 Usually, like the best idea because oh, they, everyone has leather armor. Okay, never mind. Well, that's just it. Because um, two they have an innate it's... ability to dodge attacks. Yeah. And I was gonna say, for any other class, two handed ability is not that bad until you learn the ninja's two handed uh, or you mean, uh, two, dual, dual wield. wield. Then, then easily, um, two handed becomes immediately obsolete. 
that assumes you roll ninja, though. Well, I'm just saying in general. Or no, the other yeah, if you want to equip shields, you equip them in the right hand. Or left hand, sorry. Sure, he has oh, one in general. Hey, thanks, Microsoft Edge updater. Did Microsoft Whoa. Edge blue screen your computer? No, it freaking triggered my antivirus. This guy's got shoes. He's got a sword. You idiots, we've all got swords. I like swords. This I guy's like got a swimming pool in his swimming pool. Ooh. This guy's got shoes. May as well. Uh. Oh, okay. I thought something happened to the game there. No, I, I stayed at. Uh, no, I, th I think, um... Wait, were you talking about your own game, Pastille, or Jeff's? Jeff's. Oh, then never mind. No, I've done full playthroughs with this kind of ROM. It should be fine. Yeah, 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 we know. Clap, dance, body, da. One dream team would be Night Time Age Ninja want... Chemist. Just want to play the fucking piano. Didn't you already play the piano? Oh, can you only do yeah. It? Yeah. You can, it, it you only upgrade times, it. But... you can play it multiple times, but unless you try different pianos, it stays the same level. Yeah, there are ten pianos in the whole game. <laughs> yep. I don't okay, know yeah. what. The only do. reason to ever play them is to gain a bard spell, but people yeah. do it out of tradition. We've got everything, then. Not necessarily. There is a plot-related thing in a couple of hidden items. Especially since, in order to progress onward, you have to trigger this event. Okay, then back in the town we go. Yep. Eight piano? I thought it was ten. Alright, where is this event? Oh, hello! A shop I didn't find yet. Uh, that's the magic shop. It's currently useless to you. Sword time. Oh yeah, no money. <laughs> it's magic time. Oh yeah, no money. Oh yeah, no mages. We can't enter without that anyway. <laughs> All right, nightmare. All right, but says his nightmare of life. No, uh, not really a nightmare. He just wakes uh, up in the middle of the night. Insomnia and a flashback. Because there's only one little boy sprite. Yep. Why? Blame because it's. 
Why? Because it's Mega Man syndrome. Yeah, blame that on the. Uh, what? Mega Man's hair was only game. blue because of color palette limitations. Like I, like I, well, also because almost all the cutscenes are in a black background, so of course they can't have black hair with a black background. That Actually, you would need to make it blue. In this case, it's just laziness. <laughs> And so, kiddies, the moral of this story here is that memes are shit! And the moral of the story, boys and girls, is that memes are shit! Mm -mm. Dun Always check pots, barrels, and crates. And sometimes bushes. Oh, hey, random tent. Oh, well. All right, now I think. Star, what is up? Hey, Cryo. Uh, unfortunately, this is also goodbye. Eisen, take over for guidance. Uh, All right, later, Steel. Later. Later. So I was gonna say, if it was for Constantine, that's not till much later tonight. <laughs> Kral says I scared Steel away, and I didn't even make an innuendo yet. Um, after a very stressful day at work yesterday, I took streaming from yesterday off. But otherwise, yeah. I'm doing good. Yeah, we heard about that one. It doesn't matter, I'm still gonna help. Man. <sighs> oh, did you get a tooth extracted? Oof. Yeah, oh. hopefully you're recovering quick from that. Yeah, tooth extractions are not fun. Oh. If it, 
if there's something that gets worse than that, then I'm not going to pressure you to go any further. I'll just say, ouch, in response to that. Well, now that we have the key, we could go to the Torna Canal, but should we? At this point, there's very little else you can do here. Okay. Unless, of course, you want to grind for some more elixirs like me. <laughs> Grinding for elixirs is suffering. Being yes, Luka. considering the Being... jobs that I have, it is suffering. Being yet I Luka have to. Is suffering. Oh. Wait, I wonder if I'm gonna get the glitch that Steel got with the bug spray. Bug spray. Because uh, for some reason, oh no, I didn't get it. Because for some reason, for Steel. When you got to this point, the sprite for the, the sprite for the ship disappeared and it was still Bart's sprite. You'd have to look back on this footage. Shit! Yeah, I'm not gonna go any further than that, Cryo, but my god, you have my sympathies. But yes, for those that just joined us, we're playing Final Fantasy V Fiesta, aka, aka local Wii, local, local RPG new who plays Final Fantasy more than eleven. Yep. Me and Aizen were providing guide, are providing guidance. Steel was, but he left. Yeah. Plus, I'm, I'm still grinding for elixir, so it's not like I'd be doing much on my end anyway. Hey, everyone gains levels. You get a level, and you get a level! Everyone gets a level! Well, there's a level. Also, everyone gets fucked! Nah, since you got knights, you should be fine. Too many tents. Yep. And Soldier just sacrificed herself in order to let us live. Soldier! Alright, he's gonna dive in after her. Fuck. Not if Butts and Galoof have anything to say about it.
Seaside ASMR. Hope you all enjoy this lovely <laughs> session as the winds pass on by every now and then. Okay, so. Oh, we're in the ship graveyard, aren't we? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, the real reason we crashed the joke boat, Captain. <laughs> ah, good. <laughs> Funny thing is, I skip. I only have like three, five, and seven for Jackbox. I don't even have. I only. I don't even have the Jackbox games. I only have the standalone versions <laughs> of Hunt Flash and. Uh, uh. <laughs> and uh, I, I I love that pronouncing. BS day um, ASMR. <laughs> I love it. Is this about my breathing? No, it's because of the fact that I mentioned the uh, seaside ASMR. Seaside ASMR. It wasn't anything you did. You're fine. Okay. okay. I mean, I don't get. I don't give shit for it because I have a lot of noise on my end, so it just barely gets picked up. Is there a point where I end up finally end up getting a map or something? Or do I yep, always and. No, 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 no. The good thing is, once you get to the end of this... I'll, I'll call it a dungeon. Um, there is one place in particular where you can pick up the world map. <laughs> Nothing in that barrel. Fiesta ASMR. Listen to the soothing sounds of WHERE IS A DAMN REFLECT RING?! <laughs> <laughs> I'm melting! Oh, what a world! Why are all these skeletons making me think of frickin- Where's that damn fourth reflectory? Okay, frickin now- <laughs> All these frickin- Now that that's been brought up, I have to search through the clips for it. All, all these frickin skeletons are just reminding me of the damn- Pirates of the Caribbean Curse of Black Pearl without effect of everyone is both dead and alive at the same time. Because of the curse. Oh, I didn't see the stairs. <clears throat> Are you supposed to know you're underwater? Because of the palette, that's literally it. <laughs> <laughs> this bluish palette is supposed to tell you, hey, you're underwater. Part of me should be like, why are you not running out of... I think I stumbled my way into somewhere I shouldn't be yet. Considering the music had changed there. It feels good that I'm one-shotting all these stupid enemies. I walked two feet. Oh shit! Back attack, I was not prepared for this. I know welcome to this game, but... Is it bad that I read Cal Crucial as Cthulhu? No. I wouldn't be surprised if they called it that in order to get past copyright in, in the later versions. 
one surprised me. But yes, apparently the term Cthulhu is copyrighted. Really now? Yeah. Of all things, ah. As if it wasn't bad enough for the term zombie to be fucking copyrighted. Thanks, I hate uh. it. Uh. <laughs> also, speaking of thanks, I hate it, we have a new command. Thanks, IHI. Which literally just returns the value. Or returns the phrase. Thanks, I hate it. Also, if anyone's currently interested in the loadout that I have, that is also brought up on the... Uh, that is brought up through that. Oh no, the music didn't change. Ah! Uh, here it is! Here it is! I said earlier to you guys that it was thanks. Well, I'd find it sooner or later. Or you talk about something di Oh no, you're talking about that... Since we were talking about finding the damn reflect rings, may as well post that link. Thankfully, you are a mod, so it won't time you out for it. Yeah. I'll have to mod past deal at some point because I trust you. I trust you enough. Alright. Not I, yet. I might help. I'm not yeah, in, yeah. I'm still in the street. I know, I know, but I don't usually do much anyway, so. Yeah. I mean, it's not, it's not a matter of I'm too trusting, it's just, honestly, yeah, yeah. You, you're already you in got... my streams enough as it is now, you may as well have a little bit of a perk like that. Um, uh, I think it'd be better if I were a VIP instead of a mod, because I don't trust myself with mod shit. I can set VIPs until I get affiliates. Yeah, until you reach, yeah, affiliate. Which, by the way, if you haven't, which, by the way, if you haven't followed me yet, I highly recommend you do because, because once we reach 50 followers, I'm gonna be doing a casual playthrough of Mortal Kombat Mythology Sub Zero. And I feel sorry for you. I know what I'm getting into. I have a fucking physical copy. <laughs> Just, just, just out of curiosity, just out of curiosity, uh, what version are you playing? PS1. What? Okay, thank you. The, the better version. Oh, yeah, hey, I just, there, have there's, the None of them are the better version, but at least for have entertainment the purposes. I play the for entertainment purposes, yes, the PlayStation 1's the better version. What, you think I'm gonna have us just sit through static JPEGs? No! <laughs> hey, just can't count your lucky stars you're not playing the Genesis bootleg. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> need to remember that. Need a few of us remember that freaking Videotron had a fit with Pan when, <laughs> when he tried to play that. E even Videotron <laughs> said, "This game is shit. Don't play it." Oh, potion! I'll finally take it. No, don't go back down. Oh, there's a no, there's a hole. I didn't see the hole. There's a fish in my shorts. There's a shorts in my fish. Wait, that came out wrong. No peeking. No, I'm not gonna. Thank now you, Jack. <laughs> In fact, I think I can do that. Yep, I can. So why not?
Oh, good. An epic quality chest piece. Thanks, Jack Krauser. Uh, okay. We shall never speak of this again. Agreed. <laughs> It's a fire in an old wooden room under the sea. It's safe. This is fine. Galu didn't even fucking fall asleep. Uh, you should be fine, but might I making a second save point so that way good things go wrong. Uh, you can buy items before going in there. Oh, never mind. In the previous room, you mean? I meant, um, you make a normal save, but it was before, oh, um... A separate save that doesn't cover up the first one. Now that that's been done, well, oh, there's no way well, to go back. Yeah. I mean. There's not really much else I can find as far as I know. I'm just saying, um, if it's just recovery using tents, it's not that bad. Um,. Unless you want to blast through your high potions and elixirs, um, all you have are potions, and they, even with um, 200 plus health, potions don't really heal for that much. So I'm confused now. What are you? What are you telling me to do? Well. Even if you were to change something, you've already saved over your first one, so it can't be changed. As Pan would say, this is our lives now. That is true, you do have that. Also, since you're getting close to it, I should probably help you search for that map. Retroarch having a hissy fit again? It's... It, it has a little bit of lag. Hey! Someone learned guard! Don't know who, but they did. I uh, believe this building has the map? Or at least through that door? There you go. Can I assume that on the overworld I found select? Um, once you get to the overworld, you can check there. Uh, though, if memory serves, um, it's the shoulder button, I think RL, but I'm playing the GBA version, so for all we know, it could be select. It could be Y as well, who knows, or X, I guess. It could be Y, it could be X, it could even be a piece of cheese! Oh, hi! I believe the next area you want to go to is the rocks to the lower right. Uh, 
<sighs> well, that mission was a complete and fucking bust. I think I chose wrong. <laughs> no, this is the path you need to take. Yep. And what was the other direction? Items? Yeah, mainly items. Mm hmm. God damn it. Hmm, I wonder why both of them are going together. <laughs> I just can't remember. Will-O-Wisp. Witch. Demon. Oh, it's a siren. Yep. Smack their butts. That usually stamps them out. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I barely know enough about the original Gundam series, but goddamn, do I know that reference? I mean, I guess what you were saying before is that the siren hurts. It's like a truck, even at 200 health. Well, considering she just 48 damage, uh, yeah. I can see why you would say that. So now that she has changed to undead form, she takes less physical damage. But more magic damage. Also, you can dump potions on her and she'll take damage. That's true. Oh shit. Galoof, no. Galoof, no, please, what are you doing? How's <laughs> Galoof? Oh, yeah, that's right. Um, uh, Undead Siren has Poison Touch. Oh, you can tell it did damage because it was white and not green. Okay, at least now, not that. Bad. Should start doing more physical damage. Hey, Galoof! Thanks for rescuing us from permanent death! Now you die while we get the experience points. Oh no! Anyway. Anyway, last oh, week. Oh no! Hey, anyway, last, last week. Don't you go dying on us. I'm not doing anything of sort. First off, uh, yeah. Good thing I have that antidote. Uh, at this point, I'd suggest uh, saving your potions, and then once you leave, use a tent. And by leaving, I meant go the other way. 
Oh, you can't even go the other direction anyway. That's why I said, once you leave, use a tent. Oh, right. So now at this point, it um, doesn't matter what save you use. Since um, all you need to do is just get to the local town to the south, and then, you should still be good for restocking on healing items. Or I could get into a bat. Uh... Oh. Why are why are my heads cut? Hmm. Probably as that enemy has higher evasion. I don't know. Maybe being around the dead uh, gave your party members oh, poor eyes. Right? Who knows? So yeah, that's locked off the airship. So yeah, we are. Sorry I don't have much commentary, it's just I know little to nothing about this game, so... That's okay. That's why you have us here. Yep, that's why we're here. And it's also a good thing you guys are reading the chat, because I'm in full screen anyways. Thing you have powerful knights attacking them because those Gatlings, if you don't kill them in one hit, they have quite the mean counter attack. Like that. I'm worried about that mutant bull back there. Doubly so. Yeah. Mallet, eye drops, maiden's kiss. Um, basically, antidotes, you know what they do to cure poison. Eye drops, cure blindness. Maiden's kiss cures toad. Because, you know, kiss the toad, it turns oh, into yeah. a friend. Yep. Yeah. Uh, exactly. Mallets um, cure you from small size. I'm going to guess Japanese folk. Might have been one other item, but as far as I'm aware, there's only one person that can. <laughs> Hello, it's me, Toad! By the way, this is that Toad Town now, there is. Ah! Well, 
Let's see, I feel like the knife honestly isn't gonna be useful either. At least right now. Your but... choice if you want to sell it. What's I love how they can describe some weapons like it can be enchanted, aka if you have a mystic knight, that weapon can be used with the mystic uh, blade ability. Why have I not equipped you with a leather shield yet? Oh, I won't fix that. Up. We have weapons and a shield chop. I, I, I just love the way you describe it from now. Okay, bronze armor. Jesus Christ, 400 years. Oh my god. I know this is the wrong stream, Cryo, but bonk. Fuck. In case you're wondering, Cryo said, Dumb thought, is there a Final Fantasy mod that changes Mal to Viagra since the cure is small? <laughs> what? Again, Cryo? wrong stream, but bonk! I mean, my stuff on YouTube is already marked to be for adults only. I don't care, but yes, bonk. <laughs> It'd be different if it wasn't, but since... Since we're all adults here. Paris. You know, it it might have been a timeout for using caps, but uh, sure, sure, we'll we'll, we'll roll with that. Uh, uh, seriously, um... Fuck you, <laughs> It's like, Cryo, Cryo was trying to bonk themselves, and apparently Nightbot decided to bonk Cryo with a five-second timeout instead. Th thanks, Nightbot, I hate it. <laughs> oh, hey, another, another pop, you know what that means! Oh, yeah, flex those piano muscles! No girls this time. Was the song the same for everyone you go to? Uh, it was slightly different for that one. Plus, the more different pianos you try out, uh, the better your playing will be. Uh, I can only think of what happens here. There will be a key moment there. Also, uh, I think Pan said if you search the pub, there should be a hidden thousand gittle. Also, it might be one of those hidden wall things.
Also, this game is better than Dungeon Master, because <laughs> when you run into walls, it doesn't fucking hurt you. What the fuck were they thinking? Uh, I believe you had the right idea. It was back in the main room, if memory serves. Because I believe it is, um... Yeah, it should be that barrel just behind the counter. There it is. Oh, we've also got a back room, too. There it is. Could beat that bot. Yeah, it's nothing else. <laughs> uh, since you happen to know it pretty well, you can explain to Cryo, who's like, wait, what? Running into a wall hurts you? Uh, there's this game for the for the SNES that I that I made Eisen play this Sunday for the previous Sunday because he took this Sunday off the uh, live stream and did. Mm. The last Rome Dumpster Dive and he played a game called Dungeon Master. Dungeon Master is a game from my childhood because my dad not only emulated the Super Nintendo version, but he owned a copy of the Atari ST version. Oh uh, god. In the Back game then. in the game it's the game literally has a thing where if you run into walls, it damages you. Not in the beginning, because in the beginning you're not controlling anyone, but the minute you pick your first party member to resurrect, yeah! Every time you run into a wall, uh, every time you run into a wall, you take damage. That's incredibly dumb. Why? And, and, you, and you're required to have a torch in order to in order to see in dark areas, and the torch has to be in your hand in order to use it. Oh, actually, I think there was something down there. Uh, in between those two boxes, if you try to shift yourself all the way around. Oh, that's how we get around. over here. Oh, hey, Frost Rod. Something that doesn't mean anything to me unless I roll, unless I roll one of those. Or no, rods can be used by anyone. They just break. That's right. No, yeah. no, no, no. They can only be no. broken by those that can wield rods. Yeah, that is correct. So, should so I, I believe at this point, uh, talk to that woman in between the two bushes. Okay, and you remember going to the pub with that one, uh, empty room? Now go back and visit it. So if we can't go by sea or land, then we'll just have to take the air! Alright, because we get the wind drink. Wait a minute, if we can't go by land or sea, we should go by land! You are such an idiot. <laughs> you lose. Good day, sir. You lose. Good day, sir. I am going to take this opportunity to rest Also, I just noticed there's probably something upstairs, too, I could probably check as well, but... Since we can't go by sea or land, we should go... THROUGH TIME! Since we can't go through sea or land, 
Maybe we can go underground. Hmm? <laughs> Ground is land. Okay, there is nothing here. I want to just wanted to make sure. Also, I just noticed you can faintly see portions of other maps. So yeah, uh, all the maps for certain town, I believe, are on the same are in the same area essentially. They have the indoor maps and they have the outdoor maps. That is not the way the mountain is. The right wall, or the right side of the mountain, I should say. Which obviously I don't mean literally, but just follow the wall on the right. You'll eventually find it. Oh damn, these guys are going down in one hit now. And that's probably oh, because, because of the broad, changed that's from broad probably sword because of the long swords. swords. Now that I'm getting the hang of it, the active battle system honestly isn't as bad as it was. It just takes, some, get, just takes some getting used. Mm -hmm. How could you miss? He was three feet in front of you. Jesus Christ, you two! <laughs> it's one goddamn crab! It's one it was crab! One crab! It was one crab! Fuck you guys! North Mountain. Oh, shit, back attack. Hey, Prepare to be killed by adorable cat! Hey, I remember that Nickelodeon show. I got started a little later, we're gonna stop after we get to take care of the wind drink. Yeah, uh, you see those two chests over there? I'll save you the trouble and say those are the only treasures that you'll find while exploring the area. So that means everything else, honestly, is just selling fodder? I, I just meant, um, those are items that you'll find along the way. Everything else, um, is just through boss fights that you get. One foot! No instant path! This is another problem I have with RPGs. Oh, well then, it's a good thing I'm not forcing you to play the original, uh, Final Fantasy, because... Ooh, no, I, I, know, I know it's just as bad there. I, I say that as a joke, obviously, because I play I'm just, I'm just saying, if you hate uh, one pixel encounter or one movement space encounters, you will hate a certain spot in the Earth Cavern, I which mean, is literally the hallway of instant uh, random battle. I mean, here's the thing, though. I've played Pokemon, so I say that as a joke. Yeah. Mind you, I've only beaten Sword and Shield. I did recently get the Japanese versions of Moon and Axe, so... I know there's no difference, but honestly, I wanted to have a copy, and I'm not paying like 60 bucks for a US copy. Even then, the, since Pokemon X, the X and Y, the Pokemon games have actually been sort of region free. Hmm. Because while well, the 3DS has engine locking, it's mainly only consists of the store. Hmm. Cartridges, it depends on if they are set for a specific region or not. Mainly because, and it's mainly because of the whole licensing stuff that goes into additional purchases and stuff like that. 
Technically, it started with the DSi, and DSi games can be region locked. Hmm. But that's only if you play them on DSi hardware. Like, you can't play the Japanese version of a Pokemon Black or Black 2 on a US DSi. But you can play it on a regular DS just fine because they're not region locked, so it's just you lose out on the enhancements. Which I yeah, believe which for kind of Pokemon blocks. Black, I, which I believe for Gen 5 really was only the, was only like visual enhancements, like, like frame rate. Because literally, Pokemon Black and Black 2, Pokemon Gen 5 runs relatively fine on, on regular DS. Meanwhile, I want to get a original Japanese copy of Pokemon Red. Not only because Charizard's on it, but but I want to say I own a copy of the game that has Turpus art. <laughs> I mean, you look at that sprite and tell me it doesn't have a Turpus. Nah. I'm sorry. I, I was gonna ask which version of Red, but then when you said Derpitard, Derpitard, it's like, okay, the original Game Boy one. Well, I own Fire Red at already, so... It's, car it's cartridge only, and honestly, that's the best way for you to play Gen 1 in this original form, because I don't say that for Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee, because those are dumbed down as it is, plus they wanted to be able to sell something that they could use both with Pokemon Go and with that. So. Hmm. I mean, the Pokeball idea for an item is a good concept. It's like a re Toys of Life thing that way, but... Wait, also, what? those those are poisonous flowers. Don't run into them. I noticed! Uh shit. Oh, and you only have enough for two. Somebody get the command. <laughs> sure, I'll do it. Thanks, I hate it. <laughs> if you revive people that are poisoned with the Phoenix down. That... I believe if if they've fallen in battle, um, then they get revived without the poison. On the overworld, I'm guessing it sticks. Yeah, on the overworld, it sticks. Every step you and take, good, there every... is uh, one HP of damage. Also, pixelation every time you step to show you, hey, I'm poisoned. You should probably heal me. <laughs> Not that it matters, I'm in a fucking battle. Oh god, Galoop. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to like Galoop die, honestly. I have the Phoenix down for it, I think I'll be fine. Ugh! Poison! Oh no! Anyway, last week... Come on, Cockatrice! Safe to say, uh, the Cockatrices... While they don't have that much health, they make up for it for very high evasion. And... Uh, might I recommend using a tent and saving? This tent, I don't think tents. It's better than staying at 1 HP for everyone. I'm more worried because of the poison on Galoof. If it heals poison, then yay. If oh, not, then... Oh, it did. There it did. you go. Okay, thank Christ. Because like I said, if it heals a poison, then great. If not, better you gradually lose health again than being stuck at 1 HP. And since I can't delete that, I'm just going to save it. Now, depending oh, on how much one. damage you do against this boss, it may may not be a slog. Alright, 
this boss. Oh, hey, it's this bitch. Unfortunately, Cryo Star, the Golden Needle, aka Soft, aka uh, De Petrify, only works on stone status. So that would not help you against poison. Though, if that's the case for uh, De Stoning, they should just call it Laudanum and call it a night. Hey, rope! Hey, you opened up with a fire. Thanks, I hate it. Oh, um, the cockatrices. Uh, they very rarely use their peak uh, ability to stone you. Yeah, it's gonna be a slog. Great, oh, hi. she used Forza. Thanks, I hate it. <laughs> Hello, Forza Mortar Swords. Can't believe I skipped the entire phase of this portion just because oh, my geez. monks had um, their focus command. So they were dealing double fist damage every time and just killed her before she could even summon her husband. Okay, well, she's taken care of now, so she doesn't have healing. Thank Christ. I gotta wonder, what's with all the tiny paws coming out of his, uh, you know, Don't his think shoulders? Don't too much. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, we got her whip! Oh boy. Of course, okay. unless you have a class that can use a whip, um, there's not much you can do. And yep, I In fact, know. um, double click on the whip. Or double tap the whip. Just so it shows you what classes can wield it, and if they are grayed out, obviously that class can't use it. If it's white, that means they can use it. All oh, right, because those are the ones I have. Right? Mm -hmm. I really don't want to leave you poison, Lena. Just, just move forward. You'll be able to cure it eventually. Just, there's not much of this place left. Also, goddamn, uh, goddamn Discord stream. Because let me tell you, she was poisoned now, she was going to get poisoned anyway. Oh, Lena's getting poisoned again? Oh no. Anyway, last week... Clee. But apparently, he can heal poison if, if other playthroughs of this are anything to go by. Yep. Yeah. So, even if you were poisoned before this event, yeah, you were still going to get cured of poison anyway. You're out of your gourd, young lady! Heck, one young snappers getting themselves poisoned every now and then! I'm gonna live! You're no better, you poisoned earlier! I don't really like heights. Ah, oh, get on, you big bitch! Your face, kiddo. Do you want me? Do you want me to get to, to tie you to hear you? Oh, believe me, Shadow Derpy. I literally just turned 36 about a week ago. So yeah, I I know all too well. But yes, if you like, but yes, if you like what you're seeing, go ahead and follow. And we'll be play we'll be playing World Combat Mythologies once we reach four, once we reach 50. So I'm not going to tell you how far to go, but at the very least, um, save close to that town, so that way we can continue onward afterwards. Uh, the Windrake can be able to land on solid ground. So yeah. There we go. Oh, apparently if you... Apparently you can stop yourself from going into a town if you bring up the menu before you. Huh. 
Also, um, did we want to do a few button testing beforehand so you know which button activates the menu? Uh, you need to go back to the overworld. Okay, it's not select, it's Y. Ah. Uh, that's why, because that, that's why. Oh! It's why! Well, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, I hate and, that joke. Alright, we're gonna go. And, we're and gonna, my soul just died. We're gonna Thanks. go. Through. I don't do puns often because I hate them as, just as much as everyone else does. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna stay at the end while we're here. Get everyone back to full health. Save again. And then we will call the stream there. But first random battle. Hey. God damn it. As far as I can tell, you didn't take any damage, so no, that I barely did a damn lost. thing. Nothing of value was lost. Good. Good. You can go back to Castle Tycoon if you want to. Um, should we save that for next time, though? Yeah, we're gonna be going that way anyways next time, so... <laughs> Damn it. I meant to do that. <laughs> Cryo! It can be anything you want it to be. It could be a cat wearing a cactus. It could be a piece of cheese. Who knows? Who cares? <laughs> but no, being completely serious, that's going to do it for me. Uh, thank you for, thank you to Pastille and Eisen and, and Steel. Steel. For, and Steel. And Steel for the co-commentary. And we will see you next time. Later.